fight a club. A <laughs> uh, how are we? How are we? Bite club -ers. Biters? Bite boys? <laughs> Uh, welcome back. Week 7. Week 7. We're in week 7. This is your host, Tommy... S I don't know if I'm going my slacks real big. It's Tommy. And uh, <laughs> uh, joined by my comical counterpart. Yeah, well, that's an easy one. You're <laughs> yeah. silly. Uh, Michaela. Hi. Welcome back to uh, the bike club. Last week was good. We had uh, Raccoon versus Opossum. And um, Opossum got fucking wrecked yeah it was disrespectful honestly. yeah everyone said raccoon and uh for good reason because they you know they're they're bigger they're 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 stronger we have some you know people doing mad research hitting us up with with you know raccoon for the win no contest all these different you know people were all in for the raccoon so uh that's some good stuff you know we're excited about uh about you guys coming out and telling us how you feel what you think because that dirty filthy fight needed a winner and we got one but that trash is in the dump. <laughs> Those animals are long gone. They followed that truck out of here. They went to the dump. See ya. Bye, Michaela. Whoa. Because guess who's coming out? Oh. The, oh. Did they leave the window open? We, oh, is that a chill coming in the dump? Oh, 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 it's cold over here. Guess what, guys? Week 7, Bike Club Podcast. Walrus versus Polar Bear. Go. Walrus versus Polar Bear. Go. Walrus versus Polar bear, polar bear for sure. Polar bear They're for enormous. sure. They're enormous, and they have like all the tactics of hiding in the snow and leaping out, and they're really crazy predators. Yeah. They take out a grizzly bear probably. Yeah, I mean they probably can because polar bears, polar bears are like double the size of grizzly bears. Um, they're like the biggest, they're like the biggest predator on the planet. But yeah. walruses are so fucking big. Walruses can get to be like five thousand pounds. 5,000 pounds. Right. So that means you have to get through... We, we, this is like that whale situation where there's going to be so much blubber for that thing to get through that it wouldn't even be... And, and, and then... Yeah, but polar bears have a lot of blubber too. They That's do, how, but not half as much as a walrus. I'm sure polar bears don't weigh 5,000 pounds. 5,000, Michaela. I don't think you're understanding how fat these fucking <laughs> things are. Like Jabba the Hutt ass fucking things. They're massive. They're fat sacks of shit, and they have giant tusks. Huge tusks yeah, that can be... I, I gotta see how big, because they can... They look They look so long, and if they... They just... Bah, if they just get you with those, you know? They just dig those tusky teeth into you. I mean, don't get me wrong. They can get, get like, wrong. feet deep. I, I think they gotta be at least, like, a... You know what? Walrus's tusks are probably two to three feet long. And All if right, you get a two to three foot long puncture in your body from a walrus you're so dead okay yes you're so dead fine i agree with you if if the tusks do so happen to make contact at an angle to where they could actually pierce all the way through absolutely however how on average walrus tusks are three feet baby all we're right, talking whatever. about three feet of just pure sharp ass yeah, but bone they're so that they... fat and like not okay. coordinated at all no not at what? all yeah, they just, it's all everywhere. it's a fake out because they they're so agile Are you kidding me it's like they're some... not so agile yes it is not it's, compared it's, to a freaking it's polar a fake bear. out it's a fake out because oh it's literally my someone God. no 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 this is they want you to think that they're fat lazy sacks but they're not they're they they stroll they stroll they they swim around yeah they do a no, lot of laying around no, but that's just because they ex right they now. exert a lot of energy a lot of time so they need to take a lot of rests okay whatever all I'm five thousand say... pounds it, you know how hard it is to walk around with five thousand yeah, pounds yeah but again that's fat so like it's easily it's also through. muscle they're ripped yo they're you, not they're, ripped they're so check your facts. ripped check your freaking facts they're, they're all so jacked if it doesn't say 100 percent lower it's like 99.9 .9 repeating look at those traps his fat. his shoulders are like impeccable no. and listen to this so polar bears their claws <sighs> their average oh. length meaning females and males which i would definitely pick a male because on average they're larger 
but the average size is a foot. So you're oh, telling wait, a foot what? Of their claws alone. Their claws are a foot long. A foot long. It's scary, oh, right? That's right? crazy. So, how, so how, all I'm saying. How, how big do they get? How big do they get? They do the average size is a thousand pounds. So I. I <laughs> so fight, yo. I'm sorry. No, no, no. no. The that claws, comes in, that listen, comes into listen, play so much. That's fine. I understand that it does come into play so much. However, having tusks is totally different than having claws. Having claws, you get to like grab things like swipe really fast like tusks can yeah, only but, come in at you at a certain angle that's fine but tusks aren't the only so attack hard to manipulate no they're what? not it's on their mouth it's basically like having teeth it, exactly they are well, teeth. polar bears have teeth too what okay I'm well that's not hard to manipulate it's your teeth it, 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 it's so hard no it's like not the size of their tusks are very hard to manipulate absolutely no they're not because they've had them their whole life so they know how to attack with them they would it's like anything else if you get enough work with it you're gonna know how to do it it's like those assholes who flip around switchblades no. and shit like that. They don't just know how to do it. No, they practice with it. The These speed. walruses are going to be practicing flipping their tusks they're around only... and shoving them deep inside some asshole polar bears. No, they're only used to fighting things like seals, things that are like smaller than them. They are no. absolutely not used to fighting polar bears. And polar bears are absolutely used no. to fighting everything. No. They are literally, like no, you said... The no. most ferocious predator. Absolutely. So, I didn't say that. I said they were the biggest predator uh, of, of the bears. I didn't well, say they were the most I'm paraphrasing. ferocious. Well, they are ferocious, and I'm paraphrasing. So, long... Whatever. You got me all flubber-jubbed. Anyways. Flubber-jubbed? Yeah. That's a thing, so relax. Anyways, what I was saying is the polar bear is way more able to attack, understanding on how to attack, because polar bears are also used to fighting seals, and seals and... Um, Walruses fight very similarly. So absolutely, me, my polar bear. No, they will take your don't. Yes, they do they not do. fight similarly at all. Yes, no, do. they don't. Do seals have tusks that are three feet long no, that they used they to flab- gouge That's and destroy? The only other attack of them they can. Around, they can around. literally disembowel polar bears. Disembowel polar yeah. bears with their tusks. Okay, that's fine. If they get a hold of them. No, not if. When? Because all their and, and on top of that, the tusk isn't even the only thing. You haven't even t- like. Think about, uh, again, I'm going back to this 5,000 pounds. Throwing that weight around and just tossing your body at someone with that weight, it doesn't matter if it's not just a tusk. You're going to break bones. You're going to destroy that thing with just your mass, with your sheer sheer force that you're tossing around just all your all that fat. You're just going to crush somebody with that. Let's no. say he does a swanton bomb. Let's say this... this this walrus gets on a turnbuckle and does a swanton bomb on this polar bear. That will broken back. Look at this. I didn't even type anything other than polar bear attack, and the first thing that comes up is walrus. I won't click on it because that's just going to be too revealing. However, why would it come up walrus first if that's not a common thing? Polar bears attack. Because walruses. these are fights that that people want to see. That's why that comes what? up because no. we we are on top no. of yeah. They could have said listen, humans polar bear first. has. They said other we got our finger on the pulse of, the, of, of 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 culture, and we know what fights matter, and that. That's what that means. That just means that we're... Well, you're on top of it. I don't know the fights until the day of. Well, it means that this podcast is on top <laughs> of it. So listen, polar bears are shit, dude. Oh, go, 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 go find a... Co- I want a you to co- go tell a yeah, polar bear Go find that. a Coca-Cola, you fucking dumb polar um, bears. You oh, love Coca-Cola, so I don't know why you're... That's fine, right but now. a polar bear doesn't... What do they hunt? Fish and shit like that. That's probably what they eat. No. Fish and maybe no. some seals. They definitely don't hunt walruses. What they would do is probably attack a walrus if if they were uh, if 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 they were provoked. But a walrus is gonna fuck up a polar bear nine times out of ten. No, they mostly eat seals, and a walrus is just a giant fattier version, which makes them more. That's not true at all. It's not a fat. It, they're, they're like a big. El- think about an elephant. Like you, you, you have respect for an yeah, elephant. Okay, but an elephant has freaking like legs that it can like manipulate. The wall is has, they, flopping about. They have floppy legs and arms too. They still yeah, move they around. So slow. Look at no, how, no, no. Look at how much how slow they are. They are Polar not. Bear what do you mean? How, how walruses can get up to twenty one miles per hour. Okay, well, polar boys can get up to 25 miles per hour. All right, well, that's not that impressive. Okay, that's fine, but the speed isn't that much. 11 feet. Walruses can be 11 feet tall. Who cares? I don't know know how they're doing this either, but 11 feet, that doesn't matter. That's so So, big. So you're telling me that on our Bike Club podcast hypothetical arena, there's going to be water and snow, correct? There's going to be land and a little bit of sea, yes? Yeah, Yeah, there's got to be. So if my polar bear gets your walrus 
into the water. He's fucked you, too. No. Walruses and you know, do deep hunting. Okay, that's Walruses fine. Are, so are do mostly polar bears. Water hunting. And polar bears actually kill beluga whales. Okay. Whales. whales and whales are whales fucking are huge. pussies who don't do shit. They don't have tusks. They don't do nothing. Okay, that's fine. They're fucking huge when they have big oh, teeth. Walrus will destroy no, a polar bear Stop and a beluga like whale. Bad. No, it won't. Look yes, that it up. Will. A walrus will absolutely not take out a whale. Absolutely not. A walrus can take out anything at once. It's literally called the You're king. Just that. No, it's called the giant king of the Arctic. That's literally what walrus. His nicknames are then. Who so, cares? And the narwhal's called the unicorn of the sea. Don't say that freaking pooping out rainbows, right, do you? Well, that's that's way different. King of the giant king of the Arctic is way more intimidating than unicorn because it actually means something. It actually means that they're the biggest and they're the best. Because they're walruses. They're No. Oh my god, they're so Absolutely not. If a polar bear got a whole all it is one grip and it just goes and tears into the walrus and tears and tears. And I don't care if it's 5,000 pounds. It's 5,000 pounds of fat. And fat is very... It almost disintegrates once a claw goes through it. It's not no, tough material. Disintegrates? What? They got acid claws now? A Get the foot fuck long out of blade here. flying at you at 25 miles per hour? No, Absolutely. It doesn't matter. 5,000 pounds. That, it doesn't like, matter. You don't have any kind of thumb to grip. You have nothing to <clears throat> to contain walruses, my polar bear no, with. My, yes. my polar bear can absolutely. That's what's going to happen to your, your polar bear. Yes. He's going to get slapped by some fin. Exactly. He's gonna make and then my polar bear is going to eat all the fins off. Of no, he's, he's going to slap the shit out of your polar bear no, with his, with his 1,000 pound flapper. Because my 1,000 pound That's what it slap. adds up to. It adds up to 1,000 pounds. So he's literally going to be like, get the hell out of my face, polar bear, you little punk. And then he's going to tusk him. And then he's going to tusk him. No, and then my polar bear get right it's up gonna and kick his ass. It's going to be no, such a wash. It is going to be a wash and just not in the way you're thinking. No, trust me. Because polar bears also... Exactly. We didn't even get to their swim. So they're they're they dive. They're deep divers. They can yes, stay underwater so for like thirty bears. minutes too. So we can have a battle underwater. We can have a battle underwater Absolutely. for a my long time. Absolutely, my polar bear will kick your freaking walrus' no, it's ass. Super won't. It's oh my super god! Super it literally super does not There's and all I had to do was type in polar bear attack news, and all it was was right. polar bear. What's gonna happen if you pull up polar versus uh, polar bear versus walrus? I'm curious because I'm not gonna click on it because I don't want it to actually expose anything. Well, yeah, my expose bear, that I'm saved. No, you're saying by the bell. You the are. bell. You are, you are, you Thanks, are. Thanks, Slater. Yeah. Alright. <laughs> oh, it got chilly in the Bike Club podcast room this week. Ooh. Yeah, it was By this ice-cold bitch over here. <laughs> that was Shit. me smacking him, by the way. Not a walrus. Uh. <laughs> that was a walrus. <laughs> All right, well, that was a good one. Shit. Walrus, <laughs> <laughs> Walrus versus Polar Bear. Uh, let us know what you think. Uh, we finally got that Facebook underway. I think I might be able to do the polls on there. I'm going to do the polls still on Instagram and shit. We'll still, you know, still let us know however you can, however you let us know. We got, we, you know, we keep growing. People keep showing up every week, and you know what? We're going to keep showing up, too. So stay tuned for next week. We'll have some fresh hotness for you. And, uh... Can we get a hint? Can we get a hint? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> That's kind of misleading, but it, but it is a hint too, so I don't know. Like it. <laughs> I don't know if that was a hint. That did nothing for me, guys. Tune in next week if you if you if you're still sticking with us after that display. <laughs> See ya. Shit.